And on January 10th, I'll be back in Arizona training with the team. And I'll show you guys the off-season workouts that we do as a football team. But right now, it's just myself here in Houston. And I'll show you guys the setup in my room real quick. This is where I lived during my high school years. When I came here from Fort Lauderdale, Florida, I moved here. And my brother and I lived in this guest house. Here's the word of God. Got to read that every morning, otherwise I'm going to fail. Psalm 16, look it up. It's a great one. And uh, yeah, here's the backyard. Basketball court, pool, and all that. It's a great spot. My uncle also has a gym upstairs. So this is like punter, uh, punter paradise here. Got a lot of footballs in here. College and NFL balls. I'll be hitting both. Um, today so great setup got Texans footballs San Francisco 49ers and other types let's go get some breakfast and see how the weather is outside too so actually I go outside before entering the main house because that is the guest house here's the backyard it's looking like a nice day today I like looking at this windmill to see the wind. If it's spinning a lot, I know it's gonna be a windy day. The dogs are barking at me. What? There was some commotion going on in there. My uncle was on the phone, and uh, otherwise I was going to be loud and you know introduce you to him and make a make a more uh, interesting breakfast. But at least we got carbs. We got the power waffles with protein in them. We got an apple, and we got um, protein and milk, and I put a shot of espresso in there too. Usually I'd blend it up with some fruit and stuff too, but this will have to do today for breakfast. So I'm going to eat this. Um, still a good breakfast. Maybe a little snack, another little snack too before I leave. And my old stuff, and I have this <clears throat> this GoPro Hero, whatever it was, GoPro Hero something, just a little square. But I think it's really cool because now I'm using a uh, GoPro to make these videos. And this was used during my gap year. If you guys don't know, I had three ACL surgeries in high school. During my gap years when I learned how to punt and then I got a scholarship offer to Lafayette College, a small division one AA school just off a of YouTube film. And it was all with this, uh, a lot of it was with this camera right here. And uh, this is like, just like the GoPro I set up when I punted, I would go home and watch the film of myself. And I remember one time I hit a four seven hang time with my brother and I was like freaking out. I have a whole video about that, by the way. I'll leave a link uh, in the description, maybe an info card right here on the video, but um, pretty funny how God works because now I'm using a GoPro these many years later to make videos. So full circle, Romans 8, 28, you know what I'm saying? All right, now I'm really about to get ready to leave. Got the ball bag ready and we're headed out the door soon, so. All right, on my way to the field, I got you guys in the uh, phone holder. My GoPro sitting right there in the phone holder. So I'm excited, it's a beautiful day out. Houston's usually pretty good weather. The only thing sometimes is the, is the rain. All right, we're getting closer to the fields. Super nice and convenient. This field is Baines Middle School. And here in Texas, the middle schools have nice football fields. This is an all turf field and it's super nice. So um, that's a benefit of being in the great state of Texas is that even the middle schools are better than a lot of uh, football fields for high schools and colleges up in the north. So that's where we're headed right now. All right, we just made it to the field. 
And also what's so funny about fields, if you're a kicker or a punter, is if you're trying to get on a field, just like I said, act like you are supposed to be on it. And two, I noticed during my gap year, the nicer field I went on, for example, SMU, um, they actually let me punt on their field whenever I wanted pretty much. And it's because I just went on and me and my brother had the footballs. We didn't do anything crazy. We just punted and left. But it's funny because when I went on bad fields where I was trying to like sneak in and these, these high schools where the field was terrible, they uh, kicked me out. And it was almost like the worst field, the higher likelihood I got of getting kicked out. So I don't know how that works. But um, anyways, we're here. I got my footballs, my bag, ready to get a good day's work in. Let's get after it. I'm gonna show you guys real quick what the old ball bag consists of right now. My cleats, these cones are good for uh, drills and stuff, hunting drills. My foam roller, and of course, footballs. I got 12 NFL balls, or 10 NFL balls, official uh, team issued ones that my uncle had, and then two college balls. So, we're ready to get after it. Let's have a great day. All right, it's windy as heck out here, but just to make a point, that ball contact's the only thing that matters. I'm gonna hold my GoPro in my left hand. I got these 12 balls here. Ball contact, it's all that matters. All right, it turned over, weak hit. Just finished the punting workout. It was pretty good. Um, kind of windy outside, which kind of ruined it a little bit, but still got good work in. It's always good sometimes to work with some wind and you definitely will live in Houston. So we finished that. Now it's time to work out. I'm gonna go home, fuel up a little bit. Maybe say hi to the girls if they're home, do something with them. And I'll keep you guys updated what we have for the rest of the day. Let me know too, if you guys have any video ideas, you know, my uncle's house is pretty big, more trick shots or something like that. We could do whatever. Um, and if you haven't checked out my last video, the one-handed, Football challenge video, that was pretty fun. Subscribe! Go check that out, I'll leave a link down below. But right now, we're on the way home, and we're gonna get this lift in, let's get it. All right, we're upstairs. We have entered the workout room. It's time to get this lift. It's time to get this lift. This is a great machine right here. Usually only, you know, teams have this machine because it's very expensive but my uncle bought one for the last few years of his career and he has it here so it's a great machine to warm up on vibrates your legs gets them going and that's what we're gonna do we're gonna warm up on that then for today's workout i'm gonna do mostly leg extensions leg curls dumbbell hamstring um, stretches slash deadlifts and uh, air squats lunges and some jumps and stuff like that once we get to football, we'll do the more power cleans and heavy squats and all that. But right now, it's focus on muscle growth and stretching. So let's get to it.
finished the four sets of 25 of the leg extension. Now four sets of 25 leg curl, increasing weight each time. And I'm not gonna show you everything I do today because I don't wanna show the same thing every single day and I don't wanna bore you guys. So you can let me know down in the comments below if you want me to give a full workout and more in depth on each exercise and why I do it and the best punching exercises and stuff like that. If you guys wanna see that, leave a comment. But after these four sets of 25 leg curls, I'm gonna do some other stuff and stretch, but I won't show that. I'll show you guys what I'm doing next in the day. So let's get this work and then uh, show you guys what's coming next, all right? Thanks. Up the downboard linear four net pace. Seven, seven, seven. God is perfect. He rains on from heaven. Blessings rain down my head. Bow confession. Never can they stop their young prophet from what's destined. Oh no. What do you say? Young time man, yes sir. Yes, sir. God is perfect. Look at Young T on the move. Man, finish my workout. All I gotta say is, yes, sir, God is perfect. Let's keep getting after it, keep grinding. About to go make a shake right now. Another beautiful day in Texas, except for this wind. It's not the best for kickers and punters, but uh, we gotta get used to it, we gotta adapt. So just finished my workout. Let's go get this shake. This looks kind of cool. All right, so now we're gonna make a protein shake. Got the good ingredients, chia seeds, fruit, almond butter, milk, protein. Got the Vita Nutri Bullet. Let's make it. Very good. Thank you, Lord. And to couple our smoothie, we got this green drink. Hello. You wanna play spike ball? Yeah. All right, let's play spike ball later. Spike ball. 